Hello and welcome to this week's The Positive Habit Anxiety Free, Stress Free. Last week I asked you to look at the idea of how do you respond, how do you react to the unexpected events in your life. So the truth is that most of us will, the first reaction that we're going to have is resistance. This is not the way it's supposed to be. This is not how I imagined it to be. Whether it's a flight that's delayed, you know, very common, and you're all ready to go, and then something happens, <laughs> could be a myriad of reasons, but your flight is not taking off at the, at the time that you had expected it. And of course, it's not ideal. It's not what anyone wants. You're, you know, going for work, you're going for a holiday, and the last thing you need is to have that delay. However, there's nothing that you can do about it. <laughs> As we know, the event is well without, you know, outside of our control. So resistance really to what is in that sense, just as I've said before, it, it just makes it so much more difficult to deal with. So that's very, very normal. Um, however, the ability to flow with life as it unfolds, as it sort of happens is something that liberates you. In that exa exact same scenario, you're at the airport, the flight is delayed. The initial reaction, and you can feel it in your body, is like, oh, no. I could say a worse word, but I won't. <laughs> you know, it's strong, sort of, oh, God, I can't believe this is happening to me. Um, you can recognize that, but you don't have to start to delve into it. You can very quickly start to move from that resistance into a sense of flow and acceptance. This is what is. So I'm going to breathe very deeply and I'm going to use this time to do some work, to read a book, to chat to my loved ones, my kids, if we're going on holiday, whatever it is. And your attitude to that is what actually changes that situation from being one that is already less than ideal to one then that is becoming so much more uh, traumatic in terms of the, the effects it has on the body and the mind. We know it's not traumatic in the real sense of the world, of the real sense of the word. However, the way that the body interprets that, you know, the subconscious mind does know the difference. It'll react in a very, you know, there's some real threat here. So what I ask you to do, whether it's, for example, that flight or it's in work where you had a certain plan, a project that was going to happen at a certain date, it doesn't happen, something has changed, something, you know, happens that you didn't expect. Just observe yourself. Notice that initial really strong resistance. Accept it and then start to really flow. And what I do personally is I imagine a river because a river is constantly flowing, it's coming down from the mountains and it's the sound of the river and it's always changing, it's never stagnant. So just even sort of tuning in, going inwards, breathing deep as always into the belly and just imagining the sound of the river, that it doesn't cling, it doesn't try to, you know, control, it just keeps moving. And when we keep moving with life like that, our lives flow in a really positive direction. So I hope that's useful. As always, thanks a million for watching. Welcome to the new subscribers. And also, if you have uh, already done my program, thank you so much. I love to hear back from you, the testimonials. If you haven't done it, please do consider doing it. It's just incredibly, incredibly powerful uh, way to get into a habit of positivity. So thank you for watching and I will see you as always next week. Bye.